stress test, or coronary artery calcium score. Let's take a look. Okay, you have no symptoms, no stress test for most. I've seen over the years so many people who had these silly, stupid stress tests, had no indications. Next thing you know, the cardiologist says, hey, it's abnormal. You need an angiogram. Now there are risks with angiograms. And what happens? Hey, we got great news for you. The stress test was wrong. Everything's open. Yeah, but you put your life at risk. You wasted days of work and anxiety. You never should have had it. Or you know what's even worse? You had this little lesion in an artery and we opened it up with a stent. That little lesion in the artery was never going to cause a problem. But now it might. You have a stent in it. You need to be on all kinds of medications. No symptoms, no stress test. Yes, coronary artery calcium score, especially if your cholesterol is mildly elevated and you want to know, should you really work on it with medications? So that's reasonable. Symptoms. Okay, if you have symptoms that sounds like it could be coronary disease when you're walking, etc. Yes, for many people, a stress test is reasonable. Could you also do a coronary artery calcium score? You betcha. It's certainly possible.